my name is Karthik and I'm a senior technical account manager here at the AWS office in Northern Virginia. Today, I'm going to demonstrate how you can configure ECS service auto scaling on AWS Fargate. Now let's get started. Automatic scaling of Fargate tasks works by integrating Amazon ECS Fargate with Amazon CloudWatch alarms and application auto scaling. First, log into the AWS management console and navigate to the ECS console. For this video, I have deployed a demo app on Amazon ECS Fargate with tasks running behind a load balancer in a target group. We'll configure auto scaling by updating the existing service that was already created. In the navigation pane, select the ECS cluster and then navigate to the ECS service. Under the ECS service, choose the update button on top right corner and choose next step until you see the auto scaling configuration. Choose Configure Auto Scaling to adjust your service's desired count. A drop down list appears with configurations to be adjusted for the auto scaling. For minimum number of tasks, enter the lowest number of tasks that you want service auto scaling to use. For desired number of tasks, enter the number of tasks that you want service auto scaling to use. For maximum number of tasks, enter the highest number of tasks that you want service auto scaling to use. Be sure that the desired number of tasks is in the range between your minimum and maximum task count. At this step, you are giving Amazon ECS permission to create and use ECS auto scale role. Now let's define the auto scaling policies. Click add scaling policy. Amazon ECS Fargate supports two types of auto scaling, target tracking scaling and step scaling. Target tracking scaling scales the number of tasks in a service based on the target value for a specific metric. Scaling policy adds or removes capacity to keep the metric at the desired target value. Auto scaling creates and manages the CloudWatch alarms that trigger this scaling policy. Whereas step scaling scales the number of tasks of the service based on a set of scaling adjustments or step adjustments that vary based on the size of the alarm reach. When creating step scaling, you must specify the scaling adjustment type. This can be a percentage of the current capacity or an absolute number. Now that you have seen how the scaling policies work, you can choose either a target tracking policy or step scaling policy based on your requirements. Let's add scaling policy of type target tracking. Add a policy name for this auto scaling policy. Under ECS service metric, select ECS service average CPU utilization from the drop down list. You can use CloudWatch metrics, CPU utilization, memory utilization, and ALB request count to scale out your service during peak times and scale in the service during periods of low use. The CloudWatch alarm that is created on the metric triggers auto scaling when the threshold is breached. Set the target value to 60%. Modify the scale out and scale in cooldown periods as needed or leave them as default. You can disable scale in if you don't want the task to scale back upon scaling out. Let's keep the value as the default. Choose save and update the service. Now the auto scaling is configured on the service based on the metric average CPU utilization at a threshold of 60%. So now you know how to configure auto scaling on Amazon ECS Fargate. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.